Hey guys, in this Spark AR Studio tutorial, I want to show you how you can add freckles like this to your Instagram filter. So let's go. Hey again, so let's create this freckles filter here in the Spark AR Studio. Before we start creating the filter here, we have to make sure that we have the files that we need for this filter. So I have created some freckles for you, which you can use for free. So just go to the um, description of this video and click on the download link then you will end up here on this Dropbox page and here you can just click on download and then download all the files you need to create this filter. After you have downloaded this photo you will find um, five PNGs in there, five different types of freckles you can use to create this filter and I will show you know how to do this. Now we can go back to the Spark AR Studio and now we have to import our files for this filter. So we go to the assets panel and click on import. Now choose um, one of those five PNGs and then click on open. After we have done this, please make sure that you select the texture in the assets panel, then go to the right hand side and here make sure that you set the compression to none. So we have the best quality of the filter. Then we have to create a material for our texture. So go to the assets panel, click on the plus and select material. I will just rename this material to freckles. Now go to the shader type on the right hand side and set it to flat. Then go down to texture and here select the freckles texture. Now we can't see anything here at the viewport, but now we will change this. So go to your scene, click on the plus and then search for a face mesh. When you have created this face mesh, you should see this face mesh on your face. Now we have to select the material we have just created for this face mesh. So make sure you select the face mesh on the left hand side in the scene. Then go to the right hand side and here at materials click on the plus and here select the freckles material. Now we can already see some white dots here on our face but of course we don't want to want our freckles to be white so let's change this. For this we go again to the material on the left hand side and select it. Then we go to the right hand side and here we click on the color variable. And here we can select a color for our freckles. I will select this preset brown, but of course you can choose any color you want. After you have decided for a color, hit OK. So after we have changed the color, we go down to the render options of our material and set the blend mode from alpha to multiply. This will make sure that the freckles look more real. Now. The freckles are really intensive, but we can change this by setting the opacity of our material. So yeah, I will just lower it to, let's say, 40% and I think this is a great value. But of course, you can just play around with the opacity and you can also play around with the different um, freckles textures I have um, yeah, added to the folder. So I hope this tutorial was helpful for you. If yes, give this video a thumbs up and if you're new to this channel, it would be nice when you subscribe to it. So thanks for watching and see you in the next video. Bye!